Hi everyone, in this video we will explain the updation of a record in ReactJS. I got some comments that how this updation work and just make a video for this. So I will explain this updation in this video. Okay, to update a record in ReactJS. So for example, it is HP, I will change it to Lenovo. And also I will change for example this number to this and press the update button, it has updated. Okay. So in this video we will just perform this updation. So let's get started. So right now we don't have any update in this okay update button is not working but the addition is working we have created this list okay add edit delete delete it but the update is not working so let's perform now the updation. So when uh, I have created this okay first of all I have created a list then I showed a list here okay using map function and I wrapped it in a forum and then I perform the uh, addition I added a add component okay to add a list okay it is far to add a list so now we will perform the updation so first I will add a state for the updation const update state set update state is equal to use state I will assign it to minus one because we don't have any record which has uh, minus values you can also set it for true and false so whenever I click and this edit button okay and this uh, button and this edit button so and click and click and this and click I what I will do I will perform I will change this state okay I will change this state to the ID and which I have clicked to that record ID okay I will call now arrow function handle for example edit I will pass the ID of this record and which I have clicked okay current dot ID okay we have the ID here yeah we have the ID here so now I will write this function. I will write it here. Function handle edit and I will get uh, for example ID. So now I will update this state. Okay, I will update this state now to this ID. Okay, set update state to ID. The state has updated. So now what we should do, so whenever we click and we change the ID, so now we should show here, yeah, here when we click on this, so a forum should be shown as here, okay. So let's perform that functionality. So for that, we will write here the code, if ternary, we will use the ternary operator, update state was equal to equal to current dot ID, whenever these two ID became same so what we should do on displaying that record instead of that what we should do we will display the form for the updation okay so I will call here uh, the component by the name of edit I will call the edit component otherwise I will display the record okay the same record for example come here whenever I click on this edit button okay so it will for example assign the ID of number one okay whenever it is displaying the records when those the ID became same so instead of first it will display me the four for the updation for the second it will display this record for me okay so now when I call this edit so let's create the edit component now I will create it here function edit And now I will what I should do I will display a record okay here I will display a record type is equal to text name is equal to name value value I will assign the value editor and also another one will be record for uh, sorry I should wrap it in Yeah. and it is a little 
rest with me and uh, so it is and lastly I will assign a button button type is submit with me and then so here I should write update and it is td with me sorry td also it is td with me also this one so now we should assign the value of that okay whenever we click the update button so that should show the these values and that forum so for that we will pass the current record okay the current record we will pass that current is equal to the current record okay we have sorry okay this record right now we have clicked on that so we will pass that record and also we will pass the total list okay this list we will pass uh, this list okay list and also we will pass the sit list function for updation yeah we have passed that so now we will destructure them here current lists set list so here in the video i will write current dot name and here current dot price so now let's see it what happened okay let's refresh the page and let's press this edit button see it we have this so now whenever we change this value and press the update button so it should be updated for that as okay so now let's assign here and change when we are changing the value here i will call a function by the name of handle input and also here yeah whenever we are changing we will call this function on both of them okay function and then input okay we will have here an event so here what I should write now I should uh, update uh, uh, that record to update the list I will um, create a new list const new list is equal to so now I will use the lists that map and map function for that now just l that id was equal to equal to current that id it means that we we are uh, going through the list which we have passed okay we are going through this list whenever an id equal to the id that we have passed with the record that we have clicked whenever an id became equal with that so what we should do so here we will update our record okay the speed operator the previous record so now we will update um, our value e dot so here I will write e dot target dot name if that was name so it will um, update the name e dot target if that was price so that will update the price otherwise if the ID was not equal to that so it will return the previous record so now I will update the list set list new list yeah I have updated the list now I have updated the values what we should do whenever um, we click on this uh, update button okay so we have entered the value in our input fields uh, and that has changed so now whenever we click on this update and this submit button what we should do so this submit button is in yeah this uh, um, code is in this forum this is included in this forum okay so now we will whenever we click that so this forum will be submitted okay 
the form that we have created here so whenever we click uh, um, on submit when we click on that, that update button button so this function will be called okay on submit hand handle update so I will create this function I will create that here function handle update prevent default submission so now we will just update uh, this update status okay the states this status we will just update this one so you can just update the status uh, in this function edit component also okay for example this is type button and whenever you click call a button call a function here and pass that uh, update state uh, variable here and then update that here so I just uh, wrote the submit button I call the submit function for that okay you can do that in different ways um, set update status okay I will just assign minus one to that so now let's see it yeah click update you know whoa yeah that is updated so now let's oh what happened so let's see it oh see I should change the name of this to price name is price for this okay now let's click update you know whoa update okay that has updated and now let's change the price update that has updated okay so it was the updation uh, functionality so if you have liked the video please subscribe our youtube channel and thanks for watching